So public health has two primary aims. One is to simply improve the health of the population, and the other is to do that in an equitable fashion. So in essence, really public health is trying to improve health, and then at the same time think about how health and the burdens that affect us are distributed across the population. So health equity is the ethical idea that is guiding that second aim to think about how do we do this in an equitable fashion. So health equity is defined as the absence of differences in health in the population that we consider to be unjust. So health inequities then are differences in health between people that we think are unjust. So clearly we need some idea of what uh, would constitute an unjust difference in health. And to do that, we look to accounts of justice. So the whole idea of health equity, right in its definition, is this idea of justice. So we need some better accounting of what that actually requires or looks like. So when it comes to trying to identify health inequities and unjust differences in health, we need to ask what makes a difference in health between people actually unjust. Is every difference in health between people are unjust, or is it only a subset of those differences that we are morally concerned about as a matter of justice? And so uh, most commonly, we would think that things that are socially controllable, things that have socially controllable causes that lead to differences in health are unjust. And so it's only that subset, things that we can control that come from social conditions that we would say are, are unjust differences in health. And so that's why when we talk about health equity, we need to be talking about social justice because social injustices, whether it's rooted in racism, sexism, any form of oppression, are, are important to us as a matter of health equity. And so conversely, we need to think about what our aim is when we're trying to achieve health equity. So we need to be able to identify what differences in health are unjust, but we also want to say what would a just state of affairs look like. Is it equal health for everybody? Is it equal opportunities for everybody to be healthy? Is it everybody getting an equal amount of resources to be healthy? Uh, or maybe we don't care about equality at all, and we might just think maybe we just need to set a threshold where we say everyone should be at least that healthy. Beyond that, we don't really care how, how healthy they get. And to do that, we need an account of justice to think through what health equity actually requires uh, from an ethical standpoint.